Ladies and gentlemen, good afternoon. I'm very glad to stand here and give guys a speech about the Rock MQ. Uh, in 2012, Alibaba open sourced uh, uh, Rock MQ, a third generation distributed message engine, through several years of technical improvement. Rock MQ is now capable of transferring trillions of messages in Alibaba's Double Eleven Shopping Festival in November. 2016, <coughs> Alibaba donated RockMQ to the Apache Software Foundation as an incubator project. That was a huge step for us, and it's not an easy thing to make it through Apache's competitive evaluation process. Okay, that's a bring forward for today's sharing. This is a Apache RockMQ's official Twitter account. Welcome everyone to follow. Latest, we published an article on InfraQ, giving a general view of Apache RockMQ. Okay, let's begin our speech, part one. Uh, from Alibaba to, okay, to Apache. From Alibaba to Apache. Uh, oh, I forgot to introduce myself. May I have your attention, please? My name is Xiao Rui Wang, and coming from uh, Alibaba Middleware office. Uh, this is my profile. I'm an open source fanatic, also Apache fans. Uh, before talking about RockMQ, please allow me to introduce my company, Ap Alibaba. Uh, maybe some people didn't, didn't know about uh, this China giant, Alibaba, is a Chinese e-commerce company that provides consumer to consumer, business to consumer, and business to business sales service via internet. It also provides electronic payment service, a shopping surgeon engine, and a data center cloud computing service. The Alibaba Group began in 1999 when Jack Ma founded the website Alibaba.com, a business-to-business -business portal to connect Chinese manufacturers with overseas buyers. In, 19, in, in 2016, Alibaba's Double Eleven Shopping Festival, the world's biggest online shopping event, generating uh, $16.8 billion. Uh, Alibaba is like uh, a branch that links uh, USA and China, as this picture described. So what is Alibaba? It is an international marketplace with over 430 million active members from over 2,000 countries and regions. It is a truly global marketplace. You can deem Alibaba as the China's Amazon and the eBay the combo. So next, let, let's get back to the main point, RockMQ. As the mass evolution, I will introduce RockMQ's history. Firstly, notify RockMQ's prototype product. It will evolve from our multicolored store project and come into play in 2007. It is designed for business to customer trading. For example, you place an order in Taobao. The system will send two messages to backend service. The downstream service will subscribe and do some complex business. About 2010, Alibaba, another office B2B, designed a new messaging engine named Napoli. It learned from the Apache famous message engine, ActiveMQ. We developing a new console for MQ results, administration, and monitor, using links and notify mechanism for message replication. These two messaging are designed for trading business, especially for its eventual consistency transaction demand. And now they are combined into one message engine. About 2011, we start to research a new architecture not only for trading, but also for streaming process, message, message, accumulation, order message, and so on. 
through several years of technical improvement and evolution, the third generation distributed messaging middleware RockMQ is now capable of transferring trillions of messages in Alibaba's Double Eleven Shopping Festival. <coughs> Last year, we donated RockMQ to Apache. We hope to grow the base of contributions through Apache Way, and we are happy to get your valuable feedback contribution from outside of Alibaba. Uh, now, uh, including dashboard based on Bootstrap, the Apache Flume integration module, the Apache Storm Ignite and Spark, and Spark integration module. Next, we will next we will sum up the main sense of for Apache RockMQ. We divide into five directions. First one, application integration, such as the EAP. For example, you may want to a uh, dominant application integrate with another Go language application. Secondly, loosen the coupling between application. No doubt, that's a main function for message engine. Thirdly. Backbone for EDA or CEP architecture. As we know, CEP event processing tolerate multiple messages within given time frames. Uh, since 2012, RockMQ has challenged the task of supporting Alibaba's Double Eleven Shopping Festival multi types. During the 2016 festival, RockMQ robustly provided stable infrastructure with a transfer throughput of more than 1 trillion messages. We can see clear from these figures. Uh, okay, that's all. Thank you very much for your attention. Next to my partner, Wal Gosling. Welcome. Hello, everybody. It's finally my turn. This is my first journey to America. Yeah, I guess this is uh, also your first uh, journey to Apache RockMQ all outside China. Yeah. Uh, so let's clean up the mood. Get ready to start with me, hoping I am a qualified guide to for Apache RockMQ. Uh, sorry. Uh, I'm so excited to stand here. My name is uh, Wong Gosling. You can call me Wong. I came, I came into Alibaba after graduation. Uh, currently in charge of Alibaba and um, Cloud Aliware MQ. As Xiaoyu Wang uh, mentioned before, this is our commercial distribution for Apache Rock MQ. Besides, I am also an open source fanatic. My interest includes distribution systems, Cloud computing and big data. Yeah, I'm also the Apache RockMQ committer. Uh, there are some more contents in part two. This is the agenda for it. First one, I will use some graphs to describe Apache RockMQ's architecture. Following is RockMQ's core features. Besides, I will introduce some hair level commercial features in Aliware MQ. In the second, I will cover the device DevOps topic for Rock MQ. That's about monitoring and administering. Thirdly, I will introduce full stack performance tuning experience from operating system to Rock MQ itself, especially in our preparation for Alibaba's Double Eleven Shopping Festival. Last but not least, I will show plan for next generation of Apache Rock MQ. What do we want it to be? So let's make a close crown for Rock MQ. Uh, let's get started with the domain model. We can see the five concept, uh, method, topic, group, queue, and offsite. As we know, 
message is the data payload. It includes three parts, header, payload, and the properties. I will emphasize two important uh, properties. That is message ID and the message key. They are indexes for message. The former is a unique system key consists of a message is logical itself, where message key is very interesting design. RockMQ give you a chance to indexing your message according to your logic. That's a message key really intention. Another important concept is uh, offsite. Like a cursor, you can use its uh, position and uh, time properly to introspect your previous message. Uh, so other concept is similar to traditional message, no need to say. Uh, RockMQ consists of uh, four parts, name servers, brokers, producers and consumers. As shown in this picture, each of them can be hierarchically extended without a single point of failure. Name servers provide lightweight service discovery and uh, routing. Each name server records full routing information, provides equivalent reading and writing service, and uh, supports fast storage expansion. Brokers take care of message storage by providing light, light VQ mechanism with which message are grouped by topic. It supports it support fault tolerance mechanism, uh, capacity of uh, communicating hundreds of billions of message in their original time order. In addition, brokers provide disaster recovery, rich metric statics. Producers support distributed deployment. Distributed producers send a message to the broker through multiple load balance modes. The sending process supports fast failure and have a low latency. C consumers also support the distributed deployment. It also supports cluster consumption and the message broadcaster. It provides real-time message subscription mechanism that meets most consumer scenario. So this picture depicts how to send and consume message in high availability mode. There's two important object, commit log and the consumer queue. Commit log is an append-only log system, where consumer queue just like catalog for message. Each consumer has its own consumer queue. It is also the, it is also the distributed load balance unit. We can balance consumer operation between these queues. Uh, taking schedule message, for example, I will illustrate a schedule message how to be handled. When a producer sends a message, specifically it is a schedule message, just like a delivery delay consumed in GMS2 specification. We prefined several delay level schedule message all Clustered coding is a delay level. There's a, another multi thread scanning these queues peri periodically. When the time comes, putting this message into commit log. So, like general processing logic, this message will be dispatched into the consumer queue. Uh, using data file and uh, catalog file separation, we can easily extend our message service, like this picture depicts. So the following pictures depicts RockMQ server and the client layer architecture. There's too many, too many details in here. Today we are not planning to elaborate it. If you are interested, we can talk about privately. Yeah, this is a client. Okay, next we will enter next topic, Apache RockMQ's core features. Wow, so many features. I listed the many features here. Audit message. Keeping an order of message is an appeal feature of RockMQ. It's only preserve global audit when each message can be marked by a unique hash table type, such as a seller account 
and uh, order number broadcast message you can use it to enable individuals and uh, organization to reach large groups of people quickly and simultaneously but no guaranteed message reachable there's no more to say schedule message and transaction message on the way not ready this feature i will describe later batch message it is a new feature in the last release we provide a collection feed interface to allow you to send batch the message one time one way message if you are not concerned if you are not concerned about uh, your message reliability you can use one way message sending your message to broker <coughs> and no way to act from broker traceable message we can use it to do message link health check and monitoring Retra retroactive message we can use position and the time step to retrospect to previous message. Message filtering, we can use Tiger to guide what we wanted. Our upcoming version introduces a new way to polish here. As uh, ActiveMQ, we use structure query language 92 synetics to construct message filter expression, making a more fine grade filtering. A uh, massive accumulation because we separate data and a catalog file. Every consumer has its own cons consumer queue, its only store message consumer status. So we can say RocketMQ can accumulate a message as long as having enough disk without performance loss. Back off strategy. It is different for producer and the consumer. If consumer always consume, consume failure, RockMQ will send this message into global data letter queue. Delivery quality of service. Almost all of the MQ products claim their feature of delivering at least once. RockMQ is no exception. Currently, RockMQ does not check for message duplication, leading users to build or buy their one external global storage for reprocessor. The next generation of RockMQ, however, we are supposed this feature. We hope to support several quality of service of duplication message detection, eliminating du duplication in various timeline. So let's make a little more detail about our on the way feature this is the schedule message. Yeah. There's no doubt it is like Linux timing timing wheel algorithm. But we use hierarchical timing wheel to get more fine granularity. Well, this is another on the on the fly uh, features about uh, RockMQ transaction message, eventually consistent. Uh, let's take a count transfer for example. Bob and Smith are friends. Bob want to transfer one hundred dollar to Smith. What we, what what would would he do? There's two important actions. Subscriber one subscriber one one hundred dollar from Bob Smith from from Bob account. Send a message to tell the Smith account to add a corresponding dollar. If we use MQ to Solve this problem. Firstly, we usually send a half message to broker. Secondly, we will do local operation just like a subtractor $100 in local transaction. According to local operation result, we will commit or roll back the roll back the trans this transaction. According to this result, a uh, broker will commit or roll back this, this message as this picture depicts. So this way we can reach a consistency, eventually consistency. So next, please, please allow me to introduce uh, Aliware MQ, our commercial distribution cloud MQ. This is our portal. Yeah, I will give us a brief introduction for its uh, for Aliware MQ features. Firstly, uh, we 
In Alliwear MQ, we developed our, a high availability different from open source high availability. From this picture, we can see clearly they, are, they have two important components, uh, controller and uh, zookeeper. Here, controller provides watch, watch broker status change, handles status machine transaction, and push new status to ZK. Zookeeper provides maintaining persistent state machine, maintaining ephemeral broker status, and notification when the master has disaster. So this is another our messaging feature about uh, messaging trace dashboard. Uh, from this picture, we can easily check the message status, status such as status sent, uh, such as success success sent success delivery, and uh, consumer failure. Yeah, this is our message visualization of trajectory. Recently, we published this feature, uh, Kafka Message Service. Now, you can send a message to broker and consume it using RockMQ client. So this is an uh, action with versa. Oh, this is another exciting feature, uh, Internet of Things. We can publish messages through MQTT protocol. As we know, MQTT is a machine-to-machine -machine Internet of Things con connectivity protocol. It was designed as an extremely lightweight publish and subscriber messaging. It is widely used in IoT career. So next topic about uh, our DevOps monitoring and uh, administration. Firstly, let's go in the back end of the page, this picture. This is our dev architecture. The bottom, the bottom layers is about uh, kernel trace points. Uh, RockMQ has uh, exposed its open API. Based on, it's a open, based on this open API, we can use MQ admin tools, a graph dashboard to administrating our MQ resource, metrics, and operations. So I will show you the most frequently commander for MQ admin. As this picture depicts, if you click the MQ admin, it will list some information as here. We can look at the output of the class if we're using cluster, li cluster listing option, we can see our output is such as the cluster name, broker name, broker ID, address, broker version, in TPS, out, out TPS, uh, the broker living, and uh, disk usage, usage space. So another option for MQ admin is uh, consumer status. If you want to look at your consumer status, you can click this commander. Uh, we can see another option about MQ admin, query message by key. That is what I said before. If you click this commander in this in, in, in shell, you can Look at the output like this. QID is a QID. So how we query message details to achieve it? Yeah, because of a space problem, I just list uh, some fragment here. There are more information about uh, message, about message you can try it in your computer. This commander you can use to look your detail about your message, such as uh, this, to this message topic, this message types, keys, QID, Q offsite, commit log offsite, reconsume time, the message born, the message storm, um, message born from where, storm from where, system flag, and the properties. Yeah, it is just an iceberg of a message. You can look, 
you can click, you can try in your computer. Click this commander. So, coming to next topic about uh, RockMQ performing tuning. I will share I will share our thinking about RockMQ performance tuning experience this year. Uh, let's look at this picture. We abstract our performance tuning into this picture. We tune our application from these three direction. Java application, we use clean code, static code anal static code analysis, uh, effective concurrent, we use log free uh, data, data, data grade and a back own algorithm. As for Java virtual machine, we replace use, we replace we using G1 garbage collection algorithm to replace CMS. Yeah, we're using a just in time comply to inline some most frequently visitor. We using we tuning GVM option to avoid stop the world this mostly low latency reason. So as for Linux kernel, we were because Apache Rock MQ is heavily depend on page cache, so we try our best to uh, avoid uh, a batch cache flush and a page fault. So using these tips, uh, we achieve a relative satisfactory result. Uh, the following screenshot visualizes RockMQ's behavior in throughput and latency on a machine with the configuration. Yeah, we can see from this picture, RockMQ has reached about uh, uh, 500 TPS. The size of a body is uh, 120 and, and 28. So from last year's uh, Double Eleven Shopping Festival replay, the Holy Rock MQ broker achieved that 1999 percent, 1990.1996% of the delay within 10 million seconds and 1990.6% where delays were within one million seconds. So next topic about RockMQ's future. Uh, talking about the future is full of challenges. Apache RockMQ was no exception. Uh, we hope Apache RockMQ, the fourth generation, are uh, oriented for e-commerce. In this area, we must uh, we need higher concurrency and uh, the next area is at Internet of Things. In this area, we, we need, we, we must keep the, we must keep the massive online service. So the third area is uh, uh, finance. We, in this area, we need, we, we, we need our broker high reliability. And the next is a high, it's a big data direction. In this area, we need high throughput. So this is our de development plan. We have published it on our website. If you are interested with these features, please don't hesitate to join the Apache Rock MQ's community. Uh, this is our ecology overview. We want Apache Rock MQ based on open messaging and support uh, online analytic processing and uh, streaming processing and uh, off, off, offline processing. Do you have noticed the open messaging? Yeah, this is an interesting topic. Uh, Sorry, I will illustrate the open messaging. As we know, messaging and streaming products have been widely used in modern architecture and data processing for, couple, for decoupling, queuing, buffering, order, ordering, replicating, and so on. But when data transfer across different messaging and stream platform, the, capac the 
compatibility problem arise, which always miss much additional worker. Open messaging is a window neutral and language independent specification, provides industrial guidelines for areas of finance, e-commerce, internet thing, and big data, and aim to develop and aim to de develop messaging and streaming application across heterogeneous system and platforms. We want is good and satisfying, satisfying modern cloud oriented messaging and streaming application. So we are always very happy to have contributors, whether for trivial cleanups or back new features. We want to have high quality, well documented codes for each programming language, as well as the surrounding ecosystem of integration tools. We strongly value documentation integration with other projects and globally and gladly accept improvement for these aspects. aspects. As for community, we have adopted a strategy similar to Apache other top level project. We interact with the open source community through activities like meetup, workshop, and code marathon. Hoping more and more contributors and committers love Apache Log MQ. Okay, this is my sharing. Thank you for your attention. By the way, I have a list of some articles about Apache Log MQ, except, except for the first arti arti article. Other articles are written in Chinese. Uh, much more details are here. Enjoy it. Thank you. So any question about Yes. So we know in those numbers kind of you said that now you could transmit uh, uh, one point four trillion messages uh, to your to your system. Yeah. Was it one cluster or multiple clusters? A multiple class. Yeah, in Alibaba there are two so there are about two thousand uh, machine. Yeah, we can we divide many clusters for different uh, subsidiary. You, you, as Wang Xiao already mentioned, Alibaba has lots of com subsidiary. Yeah, we have this cluster for this subsidiary, this class for this. Yeah. So, what's the highest throughput you have seen to a single cluster? A uh, single cluster. Yeah. What's the What's the maximum? Yeah, we, we have no summer up the single cluster throughput and low latency. It is error. So we, we have uh, uh, we have uh, uh, some tools, shell tools, to, to, to monitor and metrics the global met global clustering. So as you know, every cluster have a different uh, machine skill. Yeah, this cluster have many, many machines. This cluster can have only two machines. So we have no the one billion tri one trillion message is a global, yeah, global support. Yes. I noticed that you spend a lot of time tuning the JVM and the Linux kernel. Um, yeah. Are those places where you see a lot of slowdown for throughput? I mean, how significant are those changes? Is that where a lot of inefficiencies are, or or is the is the slow link inside? Rocket MQ itself. Uh, would, it, would Rocket MQ, for example, gain from patches to the Linux kernel, for example, rather than just tuning the Linux kernel? Are there things the Linux kernel could do? Yeah, we 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 tuning Linux kernel some uh, mm, parameters. Mm -hmm. Yeah, as we know, low latency as for memory size, there are two reasons for low latency. Yeah, it, the first one is a memory reclaim. Yeah, uh, RockMQ are heavily depend on page cache, so we must uh, tune in this first. The second is a page fault. Yeah, we're using mem M log memory log. Yeah, log as much as po as much as the page cache. Yeah, so avoid swipe out and swipe in. So to achieve this low latency. Besides this, we have uh, a tuning some. Uh, 
algorithm about uh, messaging persistence algorithm using just as, just as a log free algorithm. Yeah. This. Yes. Can you have a failover between, so if, if the master broker dies, will the slave broker become the master? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. So, so in this page, uh, in your chemicals design, slaver, slaver, slaver broker is uh, just uh, a consumer of a uh, master. So when, 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 the cons when the master disaster comes, the, cons the, the the standby, yeah, standby broker will proceed on. So how do the producer and consumers know about the failure of the master? Like how do they recover from that? What is their, do they go to the main server or is there, is there automatic? Yeah, 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 in the yeah. Client libraries? Yeah, uh, we're using Zookeeper. Yeah, we're using Zookeeper to to monitor the to monitor the status of the master high sea chike. Yeah. But I thought the zookeeper was in the Alibaba commercial uh, architecture and not the open source. Yeah. Is the zookeeper also in the in the open source? Yeah, you mentioned your question about is about uh, name server and or broker? No, like so the zookeeper concept is that also in the open source? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Any question? Yes? Um, is it easy to determine um, parameters like the batch size for optimal performance, or did you have to do trial and error? Batch side performance. Batch side. Batch side. Yeah. You mentioned a batch size message. So your question is, uh, can like you? How did you determine the optimal batch size and other? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Things? Nowadays, we pro provide an uh, interface. This interface have one parameter. The, this parameter is a collection API. Yeah, we're using this collection, this collection to send batch message. You can assemble your message in your in your code. Yeah, it is it, it is. It is not like uh, Kafka. Kafka using async thread to accumulate a message. Yeah, when this mess when this message size is rich, it can join to yeah through the mess through the broker. Yeah, log chemical is does not that. Oh yes. Yeah, we we using uh, some metrics to log this uh, this here, yeah, and the uh, statics uh, using this value to logic uh, to to log what the message has not been consumer and what the message has not been stored persistent. Yeah, this is average value. Average value, yeah. Average value. Thank you. Any question? That's all. Thank you. <laughs>